And a day after President Uru Kenyatta approved the supplementary budget to offset the fuel subsidy owed to oil marketing companies in a bid to ease the current fuel shortage, the situation is still far from resolved. Our spot check in eight counties reveals that long queues are still the order of the day, with hundreds of motorists having spent the night at petrol stations awaiting that precious commodity. Fewer transporters in Nairobi have also not been spared, as they are now forced to spend days waiting outside the Kenya Pipeline Company for their turn to be given fuel. It is the rush for fuel in Lodwa Town, Turkana County. Motorists and locals brace the scorching sun, waiting for their turn to get some fuel. For more than 10 hours, this has been the situation at this petrol station. The fuel, however, ran out before all those in the queue could be served with the attendants saying they have to wait for 24 hours before another consignment arrives from Eldoret. The long queues were also witnessed in Kericho and Kitui counties, residents waiting for hours to buy fuel. Papa leo tuko na shida kubwa sana. Magari zangu zote ka nne zote hazina mafuta. Nimekuja na hii ndogo, nimekaa hapa tangu saa 11 nikingojea. Ah wananchi hapa hivi hawaelewi shida ni nini. Eh nimekaa kwa uh, kama masaa matatu hivi kuanzia kama saa sita hivi mpaka tazaa sijapata mafuta. The fuel shortage has also hit Migori, Wasengishu, Tranzoia, Narok and Kisi counties with the transport sector being the worst hit by the crisis. Na hii hali ikiendelea hivyo unaweza pata vijana wameanza kuingia kwa uhalifu ni kwa sababu wana wana ridhiki wengi wengi wamejiajiri ikipiki ni zaron wengine wanaangamia watalipa rona ni in Nairobi county few petrol stations continue to struggle with a high number of motorists seeking their services police officers joining the attendants in controlling the motorists this petrol station in Bellevue area had to cordon off fuel pumps as they waited for supply Outside the Kenya Pipeline Depot in industrial area, we found parked tankers waiting for the situation to stabilize. Some of the truck drivers tell us they have been forced to come here for days as they wait for the crisis to be resolved for them to access fuel. Petroleum Principal Secretary Andrew Kamau says government has released 8 billion shillings to the oil marketing companies and that the stalemate will be resolved by Wednesday. 